Okay, so we are back on a uh, new logging road looking for mineralized samples and potentially an exposure. Posted a video a few weeks ago and uh, we're back checking out this claim. So we have a few samples we pulled off so far. You can see you have uh, some calcopyrite and quartz, lots of these samples here. We're pulling off a bunch of samples from this entire road. Uh, we're going to be walking another 500 meters today and uh, checking out all the samples that have been spread by the logging company. So we'll show you anything we find. You can see there's some cocopyrite in there. Clean off a few of these samples and uh, show you which ones we send in for analysis. Okay, so we have six samples here. Uh, we're basically just taking samples from along the logging road, whatever we find when we're walking. I'm not being too uh, picky about what we, we grab. So we'll show you a few of the uh, nicer looking ones. Again, they're a bit wet, so makes it a little bit difficult to see. So what you have is quartz as your gang material. And you have calcopyrite primarily as your sulfide, but uh, these are uh, appearing to be massive sulfides. And there is pyrite, sphalerite, and galena in some of the ones that we found. So. Last samples we had assayed really well for gold, silver, copper. Had some lead, zinc in there as well. So these aren't solid gold. Some people think that they are. This is in fact a sulfide ore and the gold and silver and copper, so while some of it is free mill, um, a lot of it is just in your sulfides and needs to be refined out. So here's a few more very nice looking samples. So we're going to send these three in here for an assay uh, to begin with. We're going to be sending in more. We're doing uh, probably 50 samples over the next few days, but we won't show all of them. Uh, we have permission to show a few of the choice ones. So we'll send in these three right here. And uh, we'll keep looking now and see if we can find any more. Few more grab samples here. So these ones here, this is actually solid calcopyrite. These pieces are going to be the ones that say the highest for copper out of any of these.
So most of the samples we pulled out primarily consist of chalcopyrite with the exception of some of this in here. A little bit of galena and uh, pyrite in there. But most of these samples so far have been primarily chalcopyrite. Probably going to be similar grade to the other ones, high grade ore. So it'll be nice when we actually find this deposit. So we have a few uh, mineralized samples here. You can see the malachite and azurite staining. Uh, there's a whole bunch actually in this little area. Uh, I'm not sure where these ones came from either, but most likely deposited by the logging company. There's tons along the banks here as well. So um, there may be some kind of deposit farther up um, that's just been partially dug out. So lots of uh, staining. So these are obviously in contact with uh, some kind of copper pyrite or copper mineral. So we got a couple more here. A little bit of mineral all over these. So we're at a point where we almost past where all the major mineralization is. Uh, these samples have a bit less, so we're gonna go back and uh, see what else we can find quickly, and then we'll show you all the samples we've gotten before we head home for the night. So here's a few more samples before we head out. So we know our mineralized area is in a length of 1.2 kilometers so we've narrowed down our search now uh, decent sample here nice hunk of solid mineral solid mineral nice veining in your quartz so all these pieces they're all grab samples from the logging road um, all spread by the logging company so eventually we're going to do some more exploration here for them. This is just phase one of the exploration program sampling uh, any logging roads. So uh, we're going to be able to show some of it, not all of it, at the claim owner's request. So we'll keep you posted. We're going to check out one last little area, a 50 foot stretch of logging road. And then we're going to head home for the night. A little bit of mineral in these. So we're not going to be sending all of these in for analysis. We're going to be sending in um, just a choice few from certain areas. Uh, basically one from every 50 meter stretch. But uh, the three we have here, uh, we're allowed to send in for a test and show you guys. So we'll show you guys that. So stay tuned for that. And uh, if you guys want to check out more videos from this area, we have a couple smaller clips that will be released on our 
second channel. So if you guys want to see that, head over there.